credits? Awesome. That's ten minutes of watching text scroll by. I don't have to sit through- Oh no! It's coming! Changing music. Screen's still black. Yep, the original credits for the original game, not the HD remake. Kazuhide Nakazawa. Masaru Ito, actually I know that guy, he's the director. He does all the art. So I guess that's the end of Silent Hill 3. I have to say, that was a pretty interesting game. Although, uh, I kind of did like Silent Hill 2 a bit better. I did like the atmosphere in this game, though, at some points, a lot more than overall Silent Hill 2, but other than that, very fair, very fair for a good HD collection. Collision programming, very, very good. You did a very great job with that, of course, idiot. Smoking a joint alone. Another world evil effect programming. Yeah, what the guy did was he took a camera, he took a red Crayola marker and drew it all over the place. He did it in MS Paint. So Alright, let's see the voice actors, especially for the HD re uh, rendition. I want to know if there's anyone I recognize. That detective sounded like Liam O'Brien. Oh yeah, nice and slow credits. Talking about Silent Hill. There's Tether. Nope, nope, nope. There were only four people in this game? That's right, there really were. Heather is named after a voice actor, I bet. That's right, there were only four characters in this game, as like most Silent Hills, there's no characters. It's been most of the game alone. I sure had Akira Yamamoka do a lot of stuff. Seriously. He was the producer and the music director and did all the sound effects. Good thing they divvied up the work properly. Oh, so there's no separate credits for the HD rendition? What the hell?
I guess not. Okay. So. I'm normal, I promise. What's that for? Unlock the normal ending. Oh, defeat God in under eight minutes. So let me guess, all the achievements for this game... There's no achievements for story progress like in Silent Hill 2, see? It's just defeating all these different people at towards the end of the game. In this game, you have to, you know, pick up stuff and defeat bosses in so little time, which I, I think I missed a couple of them. In fact, I probably missed most of them. I got like three of the, the five or six major bosses in the game. Alright, so what's this? Action level normal, total damage. Oh, here we go, here we go. There's a whole bunch of stuff. Alright, let's start from... Yeah, let's start from here. Clear numbers. So I've only cleared the game once, so that's one. Save and continue. I saved 44 times. Item number. I picked up 187. See, look, there's all different ranks. So for clear number, I only got one star. For save and continue, I got zero stars because I saved too many times. For item number, I... Wow! I got 20 stars. All right, for... Oh, well, I guess there's a maximum, and I maxed it out. See, look. Enemies defeated by shooting. I guess these are impossible to both get, see? Because you're, you're going to share stuff. So. Total damage, two stars. Action level, two, three stars. There's obviously higher that you're supposed to do. I cleared it in five hours, which isn't good enough for the game. They want me to do it in, like, two hours. Split Worm, which was the first boss. That's two stars right there. I got no stars for the missionary, which I bet was the thing that killed uh, Harry, on, and then I fought him on the roof. Leonard, I got two stars. I took six minutes to kill the memory of Alessa, which was probably the, the Dark Heather. And then the god I killed in three minutes, 27 seconds. The achievement made me do it in eight. So, overall, I got a five-star rank out of five stars, it looks like. So, not bad. Extra new game has been added. Play from there to enjoy extra features. Selecting a new game will not start with the extra things. I fulfilled the conditions for the hidden weapon beam saber. If I select this and enter the password, I can get a new costume. So I just got a whole bunch of stuff. So if I enter happy birthday, I'll get a new costume. Alright, so I'll save. I'll make a new save. Um, Actually, yeah, I'll make a new save. Why not? A clear game save so I can load my stuff. And I guess that's it for Silent Hill 3, so look at all this extra stuff, extra costume, why not enter it right now so I don't forget.